the end of the day, you want that hardware. And still with plenty of years left. To be on the, on the back end of a career and to be able to do it at home where I appreciate it more now than I would, would have if I was younger. In a situation, in a position to possibly win it all is, uh, you know, it's kind of storybook. This is one of the best student athletes we've ever had in terms of total student athlete. That's amazing. <laughs> Long ways. Hey, Scott, man, how you doing? Nice suit. I have no idea what to expect, truthfully. I'm just kind of going. Recognize that guy? Man, barely. That was a long time ago. At the end of practice, he goes, Coach, can I talk to you? And he goes, what do you need from me? What do you want from me? And this is a 14, 15-year-old coming up and doing that. So at that point, I knew he was going to be pretty special. My name is Steve Collins, and I coach Wesley Matthews in high school. Man, my time at Madison Memorial, it was memorable. All my best friends are still the same ones that I grew up with, went to school with. He was the kind of player that would just do what he had to do for us to win. Probably the smartest thing that Memorial Basketball ever did was not have myself and Corey Vernon play varsity basketball early. We learned how to play, we learned how to win, and we got addicted to winning. The difference between good and great is the great ones know when you need the extra rebound. You need to take a charge, you need a couple extra buckets. And in our state tournament run, you could definitely see that. Was privileged enough, honored enough to be on the first team that ever went to state my junior year, lost in the state final game. He broke his hand in the state semifinal game. The kind of kid he is, he played that entire state championship game with a broken hand. We were undefeated that year until that game, and then we came back with a vengeance, and we took the state title. We beat Vincent. You know, his junior, senior year groups were the ones that kind of paved the way for that talent becoming another hotbed. The identity of Wisconsin basketball is underappreciated. We've got talent. The next step is to harness it, hone in on these players' talents, and, and, and let them represent our state. We made Wisconsin proud today, guys. We made Wisconsin proud. I love the leg sleeve on there. That's great detail. I definitely wore one of those, too. It's pretty surreal. Everybody that was here when I played for Marquette, my family, friends, you know, they're here again. Being home again, playing for the Bucks, hometown team, being a block away from, you know, where a lot of memories were. Pretty awesome feeling it. It's humbling. win a national title, we didn't win a Big East Conference. We did do a lot of good things at Marquette. We did a lot of great things at Marquette. Being undrafted was the best, worst thing that has happened to me. I think he thought he was going to get drafted and it didn't work out. Matthews on the other end, stuffs it down. Personifies my, my career is, is underappreciated, undervalued, maybe overlooked. Ah! This is the point of who Wesley is. Okay, that door closed. I'm not going overseas. I'm going to make this happen. To Matthews, hammer! Matthews for three! The rookie from Marquette, Wesley Matthews. It doesn't matter, you know, when you have a confidence, when you have a swagger, when you have put the work in, you're not going to be denied. Matthews starting to find his offense, tries another three and hits another three. He's going to be that guy that does everything that makes a team a winner. The spin, the drive, and the ball knocked away. Great. The defense was there for Milwaukee. Here's Matthews for three. Wesley Matthews, signed as a free agent. He's played a major role here tonight. Yes, he has. I would put him as probably one of the top undrafted players. He's got to be in the list of the top ones ever. Welcome to Thanks, sir. How are you doing? Good to see you again. It's been amazing. You know, every time I, I'm out in public, it's welcome home. You guys are killing it this year. 
Is that a jacket? <laughs> is that a suit and jacket? The night was very special. To have my family there, my daughter stole the show, as she always does. It was special. Let's go, fellas. Let's go. Hey, what's up, bro? Hey, man, I appreciate that. Yeah, when Giannis showed up, I, I couldn't believe it. You know, Giannis is the biggest star in the city, and for him to to take a night off, it was uh, it was humbling. So you can't cheer for them because they got the Greek freak once. <laughs> oh, they got them all too. My man, Marquette basketball. <laughs> Doing all right? No, I'm good, man. I'm good. good. Dante, coach, um, Sterling texted me. You know, for those guys to have that kind of support, for them to show up like that, pay respects was it was unbelievable. Welcome back, former Golden Eagles standout. <laughs> I've been eyeballing the Bucks for about two years. The fit with the identity of defense and court spacing was is right in my wheelhouse. <laughs> it's upbeat, it's positive, it's excited, and that's what you know the city deserves. And you know, hopefully we can continue to trend and get better and get better and start hitting our stride at the right time and bring a trophy to Milwaukee. His parents are from Milwaukee, his mom's from Milwaukee. He stops at this gym and I still see that, you know, 10-year-old boy that walks in the gym. He's a grown man at this point. He's still talking to my guys. This is still home to him. That's the wonderful thing about that full circle. Three, four, five, six, seven years ago, I don't think there would have been any way if this opportunity presented itself that I would have took it. I don't think I would have been ready for it. I don't think I would have appreciated it and been as grateful as I am for it now. It means more. I think at this stage in my career, this stage in my life, it means more to be home, essentially where everything started. Not only you know, is it just about being home, but being on a winning team, being on a great team, a team that has a chance to win the whole thing. And to do it home, there's no, there's no better place to do it. <laughs>